You guys, what's going on? Before we get into this amazing video, which is gonna be one of the best videos on the channel to date, I just wanna announce the five winners for the for the friends list giveaway. So Pro, Lodestar, Clutch, Javi Pawn, Connor, and Alpha Wolf, you five have won the friends list giveaway. DM me either on Discord or on Twitter, whichever you prefer. Make sure you can prove that it's you. Um, last time we did have a little bit of a problem with that. And you know, you're gonna be on the friends list, so congratulations to you guys. And now we're gonna move on to literally one of the best videos we've had in a long time. I know you guys are gonna be super pumped and super happy with this video. I don't wanna waste your time, let's get into it. Yo, what is going on guys, Bobby here. And today we have kind of the first part to the 25K special. Now, first off, huge thanks to you guys. I'm almost at 27 and a half thousand subscribers. I hit 25K like literally three or four days ago. You guys are rocking it on the subs. We're growing at an amazing speed and I can't thank you guys enough for the amount of loyalty you guys show to always show up to the videos, to subscribe, always liking, always commenting. I swear to God, I read every single comment. So thank you so much. So the first part of the 25K special is we're changing everything. So as you guys can see from this new overlay, we got the Bobby and the new logo in the bottom left. We got my socials on the bottom right. We have this really nice, clean, slick, new look over here made by David. I'm going to make probably a video um, featuring David, who's been a huge, huge help behind the scenes. I just, I really want to make a video that just shouts out everybody. So we're going to be going and doing that shortly. But this is going to be the first part of the 25K special. So just changing everything um, from YouTube to Twitch to Twitter to Discord. Just everything is going to be changed. It's going to be fresh brand new and the second part of the 25k special is going to be i'm going to be having my first ever youtube live stream on on sunday sorry at 1 p.m eastern so you guys heard that right this upcoming sunday in two days at 1 p.m eastern so with that being said though there is one more thing that you guys have really been looking forward to and i've been putting this off for a long time but finally boys the unveiling of the face cam i know you guys have been waiting a long time for this and this is me i don't know if you guys imagine me to look like this but a ton of you guys have seen me on twitch um you guys said some of you guys are like oh yeah i can make it out that looks like him and other others have been like eh, i don't know one, one guy told me he thought i would be ginger i was like what how, how do i sound ginger anyway but anyways this is me we're going to be using the face cam on sunday stream we're going to be using the face cam from every uh, bleh, on every single video from now on so i'm super super excited i hope you guys are happy with this please don't call me ugly in the comment section below i'm joking i love you all uh, but yeah, let's hop into this game. We're going to be doing the Poco Star Power. So this video is just going to be talking about Poco's new Star Power, which I think is the best, second best, or third best Star Power we're going to have to see. But with that being said, let's just hop into the games and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the first game now. Again, this is my first time using face cam for a video. So I'm going to have to work on the eye contact a little bit. Going to be looking down for most of this. We're going to be playing with Yump, who's currently streaming in HJ. It's my first time playing with HK, or HJ, but... He told me he was a subscriber and he wanted to play, so how am I going to turn him down if he requests? You know, no really reason to do so. So we're going to be just chipping away. So something that the, so what the Poco Star Power basically does is on top of healing your teammates, it now also does damage to the other team. So it does 1,200 damage to the other team and has the same range as the, as your super would. So however far you can heal is however far you can hit people. Okay, we're in a pretty tough spot here. You do lose, look at this, we're, okay, I thought he stole the kill. We got the kill. Um, but yeah, you're able to finish people from very, very far off. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't count towards getting... So like if you hit a heal, for example, or if you use your Frank super and you hit someone, it, count, it counts for your supercharge. But the Poco heal never counted for your supercharge, so the hit also doesn't count, which is a little bit weird. I don't really like that. But at the end of the day, you know, that's how it is. Um, but yeah, it's really good. So I do kind of miss out on that 500 for healing the teammates because that was really useful. But as you guys can see, I mean, we just took out two people with the poco we're probably going to go down here but hj should be able to get that oh no he just oh no he supered the ground luckily we have yump on rose and he's able to clean it up over there he's able to pick up a kill um i'm going to see if i can help out yump over here because it's not looking very good but you guys can see we're able to just kill two of them with our super over there so it has crazy crazy range and crazy spread so it's really really useful in a lot of situations um it's just really good i really like this star power this one and the brock star power are definitely some of my favorites for sure i might go down here honestly i will go down here yump yump just pop the super yump yump just pop your super and come back okay no he, he played that right he played that 100 percent correctly i, pro I probably would have just popped the super and went back but i mean he did it his own way and i think it's gonna work out maybe not 
Okay, I'm able to get that kill. Run, Yump. Run. I think we still have this under control. This is such a messy game right now. Um, it was. It, I had such a good play to show you guys um, the Poco new star power, but then it all went for nothing. Okay, now we have the super. Oh, okay, there we go. That game was such a mess. Wow, <laughs> we have 20 gems right now. The crow's gonna jump on us. Hopefully we don't die, but we're pretty, we're like halfway to star power. Super okay, we got it. We're gonna heal Yump. Just have Yump go off at the same time hitting them. So yeah, that's gonna be it. I mean, that was pretty, that was pretty unreal um, of a first game. I didn't really expect something like that, but we're gonna be getting the start play over there. So let's hop into the second game. Wow, those guys were high. Let's hop into the second game. Hopefully get another good match just like that. You know, let's just hop into it and see what we can get. Okay, so here we go into the second game. We're going to be facing Ignatius and Canario. Now, I don't know the other one, but Ignatius, and I think how you pronounce it is, Can is Canario, are two really, really good Spanish players. So this is going to be a little bit of a tough one. Now, I, do I haven't played a lot of Poco yet, so I don't fully understand how to use the star power correctly. Uh, I still have to practice a lot with it. Um, I don't know if I should be using it more for healing, for damage, but we will see. We're going to figure things out with you guys. So this is a pretty bad situation for me, so I'm just going to back up over here. Unfortunately, our lane lost, and it looks like Yump isn't having the easiest time over here with this Barley. So it looks like we might have to do a lot over here as the Poco. But I don't think this is going to go well, to be honest. I just don't see this going well at all. So it looks like our Tara is pretty close to their spike. I'm trying to help, but there's just nothing I can do. I'm going to go down. Like, he's not even getting a shot off. You hate to see it. <laughs> but, um... But anyways, it's 8 to nothing for them right now. So I don't have that much range or I don't have like a game-changing play. So there's nothing that I can really do to just win a lane for somebody, I suppose. So I'm going to do some damage to the spike. And I guess we're able to take out the spike over here. We're also going to be able to push back that barley. So we actually did a little bit of work over there. Um, basically as much as we could with the Poco. And you guys can see, from a po as a Poco before, you're never able to do anything like that. But with the new star power, obviously... We just showed you guys that you are able to. So we have good position over here, but it's just going to go back to winning lanes. And it looks like they're going to be able to kill Yump over there. So they're going to be able to get that kill. Atara is going to go down. That's likely going to be the game. I don't really see us coming back from this one since our lanes have basically done nothing for the entirety of the game. Yeah, this is not looking good. They're giving a little bit of a spin. GG's to them, but that was a tough one, man. I really wish the lanes could have helped a little bit. Uh, I don't think the Tara got off a of super at any point. Yump did a little bit, but you really do hate to see that. That was a really fat loss over there. But we did show you a really good example of what the Poco could do. You guys saw that we were able to kill one person and almost kill a Yump's lane. So we won both of their lanes at one point. So you could do that with Poco now, which is super insane. And if you hit more targets, you can just do more damage, and it's really big spread for the Poco. So perhaps... That was a really, really good loss, I guess, for the YouTube video. Let's hop into the third lane. I'm going to get them to change the comp because that was pretty brutal. And let's see what results we can get. Okay, so here we go into the uh, into the third game. Some funny stuff happening during the matchmaking over there. So I guess we're going to be going with a Mortis and a Barley. Um, I trust Yump's opinion when it's going towards a Brawler. You really hate to see this. So they're double countering. Yump here, they have a pretty good counter on HJ. HJ really hasn't hit much here. I doubt Yump will be able to do anything. So again, the game is going to be on our shoulders and I don't think we're going to be able to do much here because as good as Poco is, he is still a Poco. So I can't really do too much. Um, we've done a fairly decent job at keeping this Rosa back. Poco usually cannot keep that back. So I'm pretty surprised with that over there. We're just going to wait for Yump to go in a little bit. Okay, this is... A very weird situation. I really don't know how we're going to win this game at all. Let's see what Yump can do here. We're going to give him a heal. We're also going to damage them at the same time. Um, obviously, I need some help killing this, which it doesn't look like I'm going to receive. Maybe? Okay, so somehow I'm still alive. I don't know how, but somehow I am still alive. This Rose is really low, but I don't think we're going to be able to finish it off. Um, we would have to go over here and kill this Pam somehow and then not die from something else. Yump is kind of just baiting BB shots, which isn't bad, but it doesn't look like we're going to have this right lane 1. So we need kills at this point. I'm going to be able to give Yump a heal. He should be able to go in. Okay, we're doing a lot of damage here. We just need to hit him a couple more times. Let's see. Come on, reach him. Oh my god, how did that not reach? Oh my god. Okay, really good play over there by Yump. Plus Poco heal, which now does, does damage to them. So we got a huge value out of that. Uh, we still have this guy on this side over here. I won't be able to 
heal Yump though. He was a little bit too far. I'm able to pick up this gem, but we do have this Rosa behind, so I'm just going to heal myself, get that Rosa lower. If we're able to pick up a kill on this BB, then that's going to be the game, actually. Oh no. Our Barley is going to go down, no way. Okay, so everyone for them has a gem, so we can kill anybody on their team and it would be fine. It looks like we got that guy really low over there. Okay, so that buys us a little bit of time. We're just getting some hits over here. The Rosa's low. We're going to be able to pick up a kill on the Rosa as well as killing that Pam. We have this guy trapped over here, so we're able to pick up that kill. If Yump can get in and out, we're able to give him a heal over there. Go Yump, go. Oh my god, he got the bats off. No way. Okay, I just got to run back now. Oh my god, this is such a mess. I have no clue how we're even in this, to be honest. Gonna give Yump the heal. Gonna heal myself. We're gonna kill the Pam. And that's gonna end a crazy game. No way we just won that. Though The two wins in this video has been absolutely unreal. I've had, I have no clue how we've won them. But though we have some two really solid games. The second one, not as much. But these... The first and the third were crazy. So anyways, let's hop into the fourth and final game. Let's see if we can go three and one on the video, which isn't bad, like since we're doing a new playstyle with this Poco and the team comp and players aren't really as usual. But yeah, let's get into that game. Let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the fourth and final game. Now, I think these guys are from Europe or from another country because Yump was actually just previously explaining to me how he also has delay. Well, not also. I didn't experience too much delay. I had a very, very, very slight amount um not enough for me to like complain or get a new third but i don't know if you guys can tell that i have some delay during these games so i'm going to be able to get that kill over there but i am going to be taken out by the bb um it's really hard for someone to stay on a bb specifically a rosa since you know she's just a punching brawler you have to get really close to somebody and the bb can just literally run around her so this might be a super tough game for us to win considering hj i don't think has won a lane in the entirety of our games so this is going to be a little bit tough here. But then again, we didn't think we'd win the last one, so you always got to try. So anyways, just trying to get that Poco heal and helping out as much as possible. We're going to go down. HJ is going to get pulled over there. Yump's trying to do his thing on the left side, but not much is really happening right now. Um. Okay, so they have nine. So it looks like Yump might be able to pick up a kill there. Oh, he was close. He was close, but didn't end up getting it. Uh, we were able to pick up a kill over there, and we have a little bit of control now. So I guess this is a little better than what we just happened. Again, it was that Poco heal. They thought that we were going to get us, and then we were able to do damage and get that heal. It's really, really good. So, again, just got to try and maybe get this BB over here. That would be game-changing if we can kill that BB. I'm sure the Gene is super close to uh, Super, though, which is like kind of scaring me. HJ is doing a decent job, but it looks like he's going to go down over there. Oh no, he's one shot and I just used my heal. Okay, we're going to get pulled. So we might not actually go down over here, Yump. Okay, Yump's going to go for that guy. It looks like the Gene is one shot. Okay, Yump was able to get a kill. HJ is doing a good job at pressuring them in spawn, I believe. I can't really see, but I'd assume so. Okay, so it's 9 to 8 right now. So the game isn't too far, but unfortunately that Gene does have pull. I'm going to be able to back out of that, uh, that super, but it looks like Yump should be able to get that kill. So that's really good. So we're in a really, really good spot here. The Gene is going to miss Super, and now they're going to be playing super, super aggressive. We're just going to keep this guy tapped over here. He's going to be an easy kill for Yump, if not, just going to go right beside me. Um, that's going to take him down. This BB is going to be one shot. We're going to be able to get that kill. And again, a really, really big comeback game for us. And we're able to get the win in the fourth game. So that's going to wrap up the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the Poco with the new star power. I believe we got star power or star player for every win, but I'm not too sure. And most importantly, I hope you guys enjoy the new setup and obviously the beautiful face cam we have over here. But that's going to be it for the video. So if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. Put the comment down below. Tell me if you tell me if I look like what you thought. Because apparently I don't look like what anyone thinks. My voice doesn't recognize my body. But anyways, that's going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's going to be it for today. Don't forget about the live stream on Sunday. I'm going to be announcing it everywhere. Make sure you guys show up. And yeah, that's going to be it for me. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.